Hello, how are you doing? So you know, I'm here at the old oral rugby union ground, which closed down in 2007 and was taken over by Wigan Warriors Rugby League and used for many things, training, competitions, etc. So I'm going to try and have a look inside. Didn't realise the gates would be wide open. I'm guessing someone's in there. So I'm just going to stop it here, have a little wonder in, see if I can see anything. If not, I'll try my best to get around the place. Okay, so that there, as you can tell, quite new, added on. All to do with um, the community stuff that was going on. Can't believe the gates wide open. I did come a couple of weeks ago to check it out, and um, I couldn't find a way through. Right. It opened in 1950 and um, this club had quite a bit of success actually, a few internationals made it. Uh, its official capacity before it closed was 3,000 but in reality, it would hold five. You can see the rock setting in. That was the north stand. see. Big empty room but there's a couple of punch bags there. A few seats, some other gym equipment over there. Apart from that, pretty much emptied out. Yeah, it was a, the club was actually formed by a, a group of friends from surrounding areas. Um, the club still exists, um, but they play um, in kind of an open field now, nothing like this. where the tunnel and changing rooms are. Quite, quite eerie actually. It's quite a wide pitch though, it's, it's very wide. Seen any cameras? What a shame when you think what this could be used for. Sporting wise, I mean. I don't mean uh, 
blowing houses up all over it. That was a nice looking stand, um, all bright yellow and black team colours. <laughs> Clumsy Dean. Clumsy Dean. Players tunnel. <laughs> that is a pity. That is a pity. Oh, that one. Right, I'll walk it round. Show the old scoreboard. It would have been nice to have seen uh, inside of the changing rooms, probably the old bath, physio room, all that would have been good to have a look at. Crossbar's missing on on these these poles here. It says Warriors on there because um, Dave Whelan, the, the ex-owner, bought this place out. It's just been spotted off a, a local. there in the middle you see that gap when I came last time I was 
I'm going to go for that gap. About halfway on, realised I couldn't couldn't get through it. Excuse me. Yeah. I'm not filming your back garden. Well, you were putting the camera to the No, I wasn't. I was showing it on the jump show, yeah? Well, what are you doing in there? I'm, I'm filming. What does it look like? Well, what are you doing in there? Is it? Well, the gate's wide open. I'll be come here. I'll be come here. And I haven't been filming your house, so... I've nearly finished. It's only where we can count Is it? Yeah. Thanks for that info. I didn't know that. Right, well, there's nothing you could do, is there? Right, yeah, it's for you trespassing. Right, but the gates are wide open, so it'll take the landowner to trespass me off. Right, well, I'll phone the police. Right. The police no worries, no worries. Right, fine. Come away from my property. You wait, I'm nowhere near your property. Don't argue with right, me, okay? Property. Film it. Any of these houses get broken into, you're on camera. Oh, what an accusation that is. So are you now. Right, fantastic. Right. Okay, yeah, bye. Yeah, yeah, See ya. Nah, I've not come here to film houses, all right? Bye. Yeah, bye. Your dog's here, you won't get control of it. Go on, Alfie, she wants you to go home. Snappy little cow. Film my paranoid. Phone, phone, phone the police. <coughs> Use the shit. I didn't expect that. Not why are you filming the rugby ground? Why are you filming my house? As I'm showing you the scoreboard. Not much behind here. Mm. Some fresh tyre tracks there. So, something recent. I just hope them gates aren't closed by the time I get back round. <laughs> oh. So, I've finally done it. I've been so cold coming here for a while. Like I said, a couple of weeks ago, I couldn't get in. Driving up today. And, um, Done it. Just one part that I couldn't do, which was get inside that stand over there. I know there's not been much to see and I haven't given you that much history on it but uh, God knows what they're going to do with the place West That's basically it guys really, there's no point in like walking all over the pitch Nothing to show you there. It's amazing how them, those chalk lines are still uh, still very visible. Right, that's it. I'll just walk you out. Hopefully, get her open. Just give you that one last shot of it. Edge Hall Road, Oral Rugby Union. And then it changed its name, I think a couple of times after that when Wigan Warriors took over. Right. 
Yeah. <laughs> These boxes of Fourier's ticket sales, maybe I don't know. I don't know. Security, don't know. Same on the other side. That's it. That is it. No, I'm out. Not sure if those are the original gates. Look at them in just... Don't know. Right, there you go guys, Edge Hall Road, Oral Rugby Union, abandoned since 2007. Sad, very sad. Right, so anyway guys, thanks for watching, thanks for your support as always, really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed this one. Not much, but um, it's still a place of interest to me. So um, thanks again, and I'll see you on the next one.